So guys, it's totally windy today. <laughs> Today we will do canoe together. I wait Vika. It's the first time in her life, I think, uh, late. Hey! <laughs> so today we will do canoe together. I wait Vika. It's the first time in her life, I think. Uh, late so i wait home and we will start i hope it will be cool so beautiful you can see in here it's a lake and after it's ocean <laughs> it's so beautiful so <laughs> hey guys i'm very late but we're departing now and i can't speak because we have to remain silent in order not to scare all the turtles and the animals who live here. Let's go! So guys, I'm a little scared like usual. Lena <laughs> is uh, dressed up for the canoe, as you see. <laughs> I'm gonna show you some animals and turtles. Maybe if they will not leave. I think they won't be scared of <laughs> Today we wanted to do something different from the beach visits of amazingly beautiful French island Corsica, where we are now. So we went to the exceptional UNESCO listed biosphere reserve at the delta of the Fango river. In order not to disturb the peace of animals and birds that live here, it is important to use an eco-friendly way of transportation, canoe. If you go slowly and quietly, you might be lucky to see the real treasures of local flora and fauna. You can spot turtles, diving ducks, grey herons and more rarely magnificent kingfishers darting across the water. So guys, we already finished. Our canoe. <laughs> our canoe. It's it's for people who like Be things quiet. quiet. Yes, yeah. if you really want to do some sport, then you should do rafting. Yeah. But there is a lot of options, of course. So to be quiet, it's very cool. Really. Yeah, very cool. You can see some tortoise. And uh, what else? Lena didn't see it, I think. No, never. <laughs> yeah. I have not a very good crocodile. No, nice. it's a joke. But yeah. <laughs> no. So guys, it's really impressive island. It's not only the sea and the beach holidays, it's like mountains. But of course, before planning your trip, consider where you stay. Because, for example, that's not the best thing to do with your luggage. Pinya is a very small old village in Corsica. Beautiful cobble streets, friendly local people and cats. Very authentic. It's quite charming, located in the hill, so the best way to explore the village is to come with a car. In the evening it's possible to see beautiful sunsets with a view at the sea. We also found here ancient houses, pottery shops with some lovely pieces of art, as well as local food producers. This restaurant has an amazing view, but make sure you book in advance because they just gave us the table for 20 minutes just to enjoy the sunset, watching the sunset. The local drink, similar to Aperol Spritz, that is called Capo Spritz with the red wine and tonic on the right and white wine on the left. Lille Rus is a seaside town founded in the 18th century by Pascal Pauli. Here you will find a central square with covered food market, lovely restaurants and ice cream spots. Lille Rus is an ideal place for holidays with a beautiful white sanded beach. Empty Pop 
It's an ice cream shop where you can find organic ice cream, vegan, gluten-free, but also, of course, the usual with chocolate and milk. Mm. Very tasty. In this place you can find ice cream, lactose-free, gluten-free, or totally with all of that. <laughs> so it's very tasty and we recommend it. Wow, thank you, thank you. Uh, well, I'm sure. We wanted to rent a boat, but it's impossible. They closed uh, the beaches, yeah. so we are hanging out on these rocks. Yeah, a little bit. Liana is all tanned, and uh, it's a little we're leaving bit. soon. <laughs> we love Corsica. Guys, look again at the colors of this water. I just can't get enough. So beautiful. My type of meditation. Just to sit here, look at the water. Algajol trains to Lil Rus. It's a great pleasure to take a small train and enjoy the view of the sea and mountains. The train runs every hour from Calvi to Lil Rus and it's very beautiful and interesting. You can find the schedule on the internet. So, Ika, did you recommend this? restaurant um yes i recommend and the coarse wine like a juice it's very light it's like a juice but it's it's good on vagute uh, we're going to try the food and after we'll share with you yeah Punta Spana in Lumio. It's a place that it's very difficult to find and uh, there is no exact address. But if you found that, you will really surprise it because it's a small beaches without people and very clean water. Huge rocks and really another reality. Come in here for the sunset. You must have come in here because it's so wild and do you feel really freedom place with very beautiful sunset and tasty seafood on the wild beach but you must book that before two or three days It's 
our last dinner in a very beautiful place, unfortunately the last. We hope this uh, short vlog about our trip you will uh, really like and um, you will type in the commentary and something. Yeah, what would you like to see maybe next time and what you like hey this time. So, that's something. Thank you guys. From course. <laughs>